you want to count down? Yeah? Everyone ready? Okay. Three, two, one, go. <laughs> by profession and um, so it's been my role uh, to organize everybody and to teach them and to help them learn new skills so that together we could make these large mosaics. One of the biggest problems with uh, drug and alcohol misuse is that when people it is people trying to get back into doing things and getting people back into an interesting life and involved with things. I've been doing mosaic making for about six months now. I started it. So, um, Tessa came to my weekly chambery project. Just about five minutes away from here. I thought I'd try that and I've tried it and I liked it. I've been doing it since. <coughs> A lot of group work, people get very self-conscious, they feel as though they're expected to talk, they're expected to say, say things, and this takes away that kind of stress. And I think it's just been invaluable, and you see the effect that it's had on a number of the service users. Coming here as well, I feel like I'm in a safe environment, I don't feel threatened, anybody's going to come up and say, oh, do you want to go to use, or whatever. So that's another part of it, because if it was like that, I would have to take myself away. Actually, I was just strolling past and saw some activity and decided that I'd have a look and see what it was about. And um, I thought, no, I really like to do that. I've not done it before. So I thought I'd have a go, and it's great. Thoroughly enjoying it. I'm trying to work my colours out here, from dark to light. just been completely bowled over by her dedication, her patience, her resilience. I mean, it's been, she's gone through, she just pressed it and pressed it and pressed it and got it working. I mean, she's got such a wonderful manner with the service users. She gets, she's patient with them, she's friendly, doesn't have any, doesn't seem to have any sort of particular expectations of them, and just lets them be themselves. So now he's got one shiny eye and one dull eye. Does that worry you? We've got another bit. If you, if, I think you could cut this into a triangle. Let me just show you. You just put the tool across, so on a diagonal. Yeah. From corner yeah. to corner. Try that. And then squeeze gently. And I think it will, it will happen. We had a room, room full of young children for all day, and uh, yeah, as Nikki says, they're, they're quite, there's quite some quite strong characters. <laughs> Everybody up and they make us laugh. 
My name is Victoria Luzo. They like to run the cafe and they um, they make attempts to make us all tea. I'm going to get the tea bag. This is too milky. Hello. Put more sugar in it. For that, and I'm very slow. And how are you getting on with it? Well, as so I say, I'm slow. being extra. I think poor Tessa is coming to the end of the tether. No, that yeah. way. I've got, I think I've got the reputation for being the slowest <laughs> maker in the whole, <laughs> the whole, the whole of the project. And uh, I, there was a great danger that I was going to be the last person to complete my name with the, the background. And the, the one person I thought I might be able to finish in front of was Nikki. Mm -hmm. Okay. And because you have quite a lot to finish. And uh, he beat me. I was really, really upset at you, so I, 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 I was the last I got help from Tessa. Yeah. <laughs> well, I think you did it pretty well on your own. Yeah. Uh, you cheated, actually. You cheated, cheated by using the time. You know? <laughs> <laughs> I, should, <laughs> I, don't, I don't even write it. I've had skulls on my <laughs> Issues really no, either. that's right. It seems to be a sort of, it's a little bit as if it's an oasis or something. Mm. It's kind of cut off from the rest of the world, really. Um, you know, partly the classical music and the weird activity, but it, and it's very engrossing. And I think one of the things I like about it is that um, quite often everybody works in silence. Mm. And it's a very sort of comfortable silence. You yeah. don't feel awkward no. if nobody's saying anything because everybody's busy and you can, you can feel in the air sort of concentration. Yeah, so it definitely. doesn't feel like an empty silence. No. 